I don't know if you've been watching the news lately, but your president from 2008, 10 years ago today, or 10 years ago this year, your president, your favorite president that you voted for, talk about we don't need a messiah. We don't need a messiah. Uh, dear government, dear whoever told you to say that shit, only people look for a messiah is Israel. The children of Israel. That's the only people that's looking for a messiah. You see what I'm saying? Because I'm not looking for the antichrist. You see what I'm saying? Mr. Obama. Or should I say, Lucifer, Satan, Barack Obama. I mean, I know who you is since you said we don't need a savior. I guess you want to try to be the savior. I guess you want to be the savior. You want to put all these churches together from the wrong, the seven churches. I guess you want to do this, Mr. Obama. See, you here, the plan, like you from here. I know where you're from. You're from Egypt. You're not from Israel, dog. And you're not for no Hebrew. You see what I'm saying? You're not for the 12 tribes. So, Mr. Obama, and I guess the people that's worshiping you, do you understand what you what you in? And the people that's, I guess you could say, adding on to this circus, do you know what you what you into? I mean, do you know what's going on in this in this time? In this time, do you know what's going on? I mean, you voted for Satan to come on in here and take your government over. Lucifer, Satan. All of that shit. You from overseas, Egypt, Russia, Rome. You from over there, Turkey. You know what I mean? What they used to call in the Bible, Assyrian. What they call it today, Syria. Come on, man. What is you, what is you doing? What is you people doing, dog? You don't see Satan in the flesh, and you playing around. So, Mr. Obama, who's going to be the Messiah then, if we don't need one? If we don't need a Messiah, I hope you ain't trying to be the Messiah that every child of God is waiting on. I hope you're not trying to be the Messiah. You know what I mean? Because I've been reading Revelations 12, 1. And the, but in the time that you said that shit is when the time I was reading Revelations 12, 1. So, what is you doing Obama, I mean, because last time I checked, Donald Trump was president. How, what is you, the Antichrist and the Beast? I mean, it makes sense now. It makes way more sense now. The Antichrist and the Beast. It makes more sense. You got everybody sleep out here. And y'all voting, voting for Satan and shit and don't know what the fuck you voting you out here want to be a part of something, some government, and don't know you a part of Satan's government. But you want to be a part of shit. So 2008, you elected this man to come in here. You elected Satan to come in here and didn't even know. Didn't even fucking know. He telling you, you don't need a Messiah. You don't need a Jesus. You don't need that. He's saying that shit, that he's your, your Jesus. So he knows you waiting on a Messiah. So he's telling you, Blankly that you don't need one. Are you are you catching the drift? Are you catching the drift? Of what this man is doing? So your eyes is not open to the shit. What you your eyes want to be open when when it's happening, and you can't do nothing about it because you didn't prepare yourself. You didn't prepare yourself. So I mean I know you jumping out the sky out of out of heaven onto the earth. <laughs> I know you're doing all that because I read the scriptures. You know what I mean? You're talking about Messiah. I'm Gad out here, dog. So once you understand Gad, Lucifer, or should I say Baal, 
You see, when, when you when, once you find out who Gad is, then me and you can talk. You see what I'm saying? Because you're the same system that's doing this shit. Roman Empire. The Roman. The Greek. Come on, man. Ain't nothing new. Ain't nothing new. Under the sun. So, you think I don't need a Jesus to come and save me. I sure don't believe that you can save America because you're not fucking Jesus, dog. You are Donald Trump. Can't save America. You can't make America great. What you can do is bring the great Bible on as what you're doing. That's what you can do. Bring, fulfill Satan's agenda. That's what you can do. See, you talking about, you should be saying we don't need an antichrist. You going to fuck around and say we don't need a messiah. So, Mr. Obama, what do we need? Because I'm the people, dog. I'm the people. The, the people elected you. We don't need you in the White House, wherever your ass was at, talking about we don't need a Messiah. We don't need that. Because we, the people that you're governing around you, need that. So what is you on? Are you on Satan's agenda? Satan's Lucifer? Are you falling from the sky, Lucifer? You, you, you're falling from the sky, Lucifer? And then the, you, you, you fell from the sky... In, in Revelation 12, 1, then your ass want to hit the government, talk about we don't need a Messiah. Where was your ass at 10 years ago, dog? Where was you at 10 years ago? And then you just hit the scene. You just hit the scene. It's been 10 years, dog. 10 years. And you talking about we don't need a Messiah. Where was you at? Overseas? Where was you at? In Egypt? In Russia? Where was you at then? In Syria? Turkey? I mean, where you been at for 10 years, dog, to come over here and say we don't need a Messiah? Where you been at, dog? That's what I'm saying. Y'all out here don't know who the fuck govern you, just letting Satan govern you. Don't know no scripture in the Bible, but that's what we're going through right now. But you talk about you love Jesus. You love Yahshua. But you don't even know Yahshua is. You about to fuck around and give your life to the Antichrist. Not knowing going with the world. Because you're, you're part of the world. You're part of the world, Craig. And you're going to go with it. But you all in but you all in a church house talking about, Lord, forgive you for your sins. But you know no scriptures. You know no prophecy. But back to you, Satan, Lucifer. Hey, cut that shit out, dog. Because my God, Yahshua, the God of Israel, he will be here, dog. And you ain't going to stop that shit. You understand? You not going to stop Jesus from coming, dog. Understand that shit. You or your government, your, your seven churches, your, the beast. I mean, come on. Daniel seen the vision. Daniel seen the vision. Daniel seen the vision. So, so what's up? What's up? Daniel seen the vision. So you're not going to stop nothing. What's about to happen, Babylon's about to fall, dog. Babylon's about to fall. That's what's about to happen. Your God, Baal, about to get destroyed. All them gods, Nimrod, about to get destroyed. Isis, about to get crushed. Ishtar, all them pagan-ass gods about to get crushed. So what the fuck is you talking about? That's what I'm saying, dog. That's what I'm saying. You can't just come up out here talking about we don't need a Messiah. You can't say that, dog. You can't come out here and say that. Because I'm believing you the Antichrist. Like, what type of shit? Who who does shit like that? I mean, I'm, I'm from Israel. You see what I'm saying? So I don't know what you're saying, dog. Like, it sounds like anti-talk. Antichrist. Because I'm from Israel, dog. You see what I'm saying? I told you I was gad up out here, dog. Don't let me have this conversation no more. We don't need a Messiah. But the Messiah is going to come if, we, if you don't want it to or not. It's just prophecy, player.